Hey guys, Carolina Rippers back with another video for you. Uh, today we have a brand new product from one of our favorite companies, Wildcard. You guys have been with us for a while. You know how much we like Wildcard. Uh, Illumination. This is a set that's been around uh, for at least three years now. This is the third year we've opened it. Um, now, they have completely changed the product this year, though. Um, and y'all tell us whether you think it's for the better or not. I, I kind of like the change. So... Uh, the last two years, this has been like a normal set um, where you get like five autos in the box. It's like six packs of 10 or 12 cards. I can't remember exactly how many are in there, but it's like a regular set of cards. You get base cards, you get some inserts, and then you get an auto in each pack um, or at least five out of the six packs. So they were, they're pretty good, um, but they've changed it this year. They've gotten rid of all the extra base cards and all that. Now it is only six autographs. So it's going to be individually wrapped. These are going to be just like the wild card Automania and the wild card um, five card draw, where they're individually wrapped in a in a pack per uh, one different pack for every autograph. These are all, I believe, all in mags in this. Um, this is a heavy box. Um, let me look and see. All right, so here you go, the back of the box. Here's how it's going to work. You get three what they just call auto packs, so just three base packs. Um, then you're going to get, and, and each one's an auto, individually wrapped. They look like this. Then two premium autos, numbered to 25 or less. And then one super premium that is numbered to five or less. And all of them, I believe it said they were in mags. And I saw an opening of this. I believe that's true. So here's a list of some of the guys that are in here. These, This is a draft product. that is college jerseys. Um, it is the new 2023 draft class. So, of course, we're looking for Bryce Young. Um, I don't believe Jonathan Mingo is in here. I think I think Bryce Young is the only Panther. It's a somewhat of a limited um, uh, checklist, which is good. I mean, it, I kind of like that for the single auto type products where it's like an auto per pack. I don't, yeah, want, I don't want any of the lower guys. Yeah, I don't want a million auto because you might get these boxes that just have nobody good. So, yeah, we have not pulled a Bryce Young yet. So we are still looking for our first Bryce Young for our PC. So let's see. And y'all know we love uh, Wildcard. Um, Wildcard, I know you guys watch our videos sometimes. Thanks for doing that and watching. Um, hopefully this this goes well. I love and and the packaging for Wildcard always cool. Even just the front of the box looks neat. I'll put it right there. Here we go. Six autos. Now we did get this. Um, we got these from our distributor. Uh, I didn't ever see these go on sale. Um, sometimes Wildcard will do them if, if you sign up on their website. You can be um, an inside trader, they call it, and they'll let you know you can buy them direct from them. And those boxes will usually be a little more juiced up. Like they're they're good pricing, and then they'll throw in something extra in there. Um, I didn't see those this time, so I got these from my distributor. So all good. I mean, these are still going to be awesome. Yeah, these are definitely mags. That, that alone, I mean, you think about it, six mags by themselves is like... 20 30 bucks and these boxes are going for like 150 so pretty cool all right so we'll do the base versions first i i'm not sure if they're all numbered or not uh we'll see how that goes i i know it's not guaranteed to be numbered on all of them so here we go here's number one keon white so cole you got to look these up that that is a black card really nice looking card wow what do you think of the design, man? That is that is a really clean design. Yeah, this is cool. Patriot, second round. Second round pick. That is three of 25. Keon White for the Patriots. Second round pick. That's a really nice looking card, too. Look at that. I really, really like the design. It's hard to tell centering because they made them a little different, but they look it looks pretty close. I think it's pretty well centered. All right, so D-line on the first one, but it was numbered. Very, very cool. All right. And, and this shouldn't be too long of a video either. I mean, these there's only six cards here. All right. Ooh, this is like a silver. Luke Musgrave. That's a pretty good one. Luke Musgrave was uh, the second uh, tight end taken in the draft. Early second round pick for the Packers. Is that right? Packers? Win at Green Bay? Yeah. Musgrave. This one's out of 75. 44 of 75 Luke Musgrave. So that's like a silver. I wonder if that's the... Is that the fourth tight end? Fourth tight end? No. 
Who else was before? Michael Mayer, Sam oh. Laporta. Wow, okay, he was fourth. My bad. Kincaid. I thought, oh, that's right. They traded up to get Mayer. I thought he went before Mayer. This was a guy the Panthers were looking at as well. If I'm not mistaken, he was the guy that got injured in his last year, so he didn't get to play. I wonder if that played into it. But he was he was supposed to be good. This was supposed to be a very deep tight end class. So, yeah, we'll see. Panthers, uh, Panthers did not get any of the tight ends, which was a little disappointing, but I am glad. I, I do like their draft class. All right, this looks like the same card. Like, the coloring is exactly the same. Princeton Fant. I wonder if that's Noah Fant's relative. That one's out of 75 as well. 12 of 75 for Tennessee. Where did he get drafted, Cole? Definitely. Did he get drafted? Now, he could still be in college because these these are NIL boxes now. All this draft stuff. Um, there he goes. Hold on. Yeah. Was he drafted? No. So, uh, I guess undrafted free agent for the Cowboys. Huh, okay. So, they were all numbered, though. That's pretty cool. So, we got one out of 25, and then these two were out of 75. The other thing I'll show you on here, it doesn't show you the design, but I believe the premium auto and the super premium, they're not going to be base versions like this. This is like the base design. I believe these are going to be um, a different design altogether. All right, so nothing huge yet. I'd say the Musgrove is the, the biggest one. Come on, give us a Bryce. Need a Bryce Young. I don't have one yet. Come on. Come on, wild card. Come through for me. Zay Flowers. That's pretty big. Look at that. It's a shimmer. Black shimmer. Dude, that's a nice looking card. Look at that. It's a weird auto, though. Yeah, that is kind I like, of I like the design, though, that, it, of his auto. At least it has a purpose to only being two letters. Come on, be low numbered. Out of 15, bro. Five of 15. This guy went to the Ravens. Baltimore Ravens. I, I feel a little bit bad for him because I am not a Lamar Jackson fan. I don't I don't think he's gonna have a plethora of passes to him. That's a word. You've you challenged me on that before. It is a word, plethora. So but Zay Flowers, that's a pretty big one. He was the second wideout off the board or third. Third? Yep, third. They all yeah. they're all there together. So that's pretty sweet. I'll take a Zay Flowers for sure. I really like these. So I was wrong though. The design is the same. I thought the design would be different, yeah, but maybe it's red. And it's out of 15. Well, then it's a shimmer. All right, come on. Keep the keep the fire going. Ooh, this one's got some. This has got gold coloring. Broderick Jones from Georgia. That's like a gold. 18 of 20. Broderick Jones. O-line. You definitely don't want to see the O-line. Pretty cool. You looking him up? Who is it? My bad. What are you doing? I zoned out. You're zoning out. We make Rod... like a 10-minute video and the kid can't focus. Broderick Martin? Broderick Jones. Oh, Broderick. I can't read it. Steelers. First round pick of the Steelers. Nice. Pittsburgh's first round pick. And it's, it's kind of Steelers colors there with the gold and black shimmer. I like that. All right, Steelers fans, how much you want for this one? Or how much you give me for this one? A couple hundred? 300? 400? Yeah, I hear you. We'll, we'll, we'll field some offers, you know. A little O-line love for the Steelers. All right. Now, for some reason, this is this is the super premium. This should be out of, uh, out of five or less. So this was out of 15. This one was out of 20. This should be five or less. You can get one-on-ones. You can get one-on-ones for any of these. So, all right, here we go. Come on. Man. What would you do if this was Bryce? That is the back of the pack. What would you do if it was Bryce Young? Watch you freak out. We'd go crazy. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh, it's rainbow colored. I think we might have a one on one. Oh, Pete Pete Skaronsky. Ocular. One of three. Unfortunately, another O lineman. Dang it. Yeah, he was an early pick. Tennessee Titans. He was one of the first O linemen. Um, Paris Johnson. Let's see. Paris Johnson, then Darnell Wright, and then Pete Skaronsky. Man, unfortunately, our lowest numbered stuff was not Pete? the best. I don't know. Much. One out of three. Tennessee Titans on that one. Really, really cool card, though. The Ocular is one of the inserts um, from Illumination. 
That's a really neat design though. Let me hold that closer for you guys. Pretty neat. The Zay Flower is definitely the big hit of the box though. I think that's the, I mean, out of 15 Zay Flowers. Definitely take that. But really good value. I mean, you're getting six autographs. They're all in mags. All of ours were numbered. I think the other boxes I've seen were the same where everything was numbered and they're pretty low numbered too. So it's kind of like the Leaf products, but I, I love these so much more than Leaf. The designs are just so much better. Don't you think? Yeah. Um, I, I like it. I'm, I'm happy with the Zay Flowers Luke Musgraves. I mean, overall, really nice product. What do you think, Cole? What do you think on the uh, ranking? What do you give it? I really like the design. It's it's kind of annoying that they're all pretty much the same. But, I don't know, I, I give it a six and a half. Wow, that's low. Six and a half. Why'd you drop it down? Well, it's kind of like their other product. Uh, what's the other auto one that they have? I can't remember names. They have a lot of different ones. They have Automania. They have... Yeah, I'm thinking of Automania. I think. Um, but like, they have the five-card draw. I like these better than five-card draw. Now, that the numbering's better on five-card draw because they're all out yeah. of five or less, but you only get five instead of six. I don't know. I can't give it a six and a half. I'd give it a seven. Seven and a half, probably. I like, But I do agree with you. I, I, I like that the finishes are different. They get nicer as you get the lower numbers. Um, but yeah, I think it'd be neat if these were like different designs than those, but overall, I like it. I'm gonna give it a seven and a half. Well, there you go, guys. First look at some illumination for 2023. Tell us what you think of the change to make it an all auto product. Um, and let us know what you think of the design. Apparently, you know, Cole doesn't like it because, you know, he's just one of those teenagers. Nothing ever makes him happy. You know? Hope you guys have a great rest of your week and weekend. We'll see you again soon. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and we'll see you soon.